Hi guys, this is Tejas and uh, today we will be unboxing the uh, Bose Stone 1000 which is the Bluetooth speaker. So, do you like Bose? Do you like JBL? But do you have the budget? So, in this budget, I would say that this is a monster and uh, uh, I would be unboxing this. We will be playing a uh, sample audio and then I will be giving you a frank opinion about this uh, Bluetooth speaker. And uh, trust me, this is very heavy. So let's just quickly unbox this box. You guys, I have not wasted much time of getting that uh, from the box and uh, showing you the uh, packages. But overall, um, the packing was good, and uh, this all things were in the box. Like we have the uh, USB cable, so to charge the uh, the speaker and the uh, 3.5 to 3.5 mm jack. So we get this uh, user manual and a warranty card. Uh, over here it says that um, the frequency range is from uh, 20 hertz to 20,000 hertz. So uh, the bass would be punchy and uh, uh, the normal logic is uh, lower the frequency higher the bass. So again I would say the bass would be uh, up to the mark. So uh, again uh, the battery is uh, 3000 mAh so uh, it gives us the uh, playing time of about uh, 8 to 9 hours roughly and the charging time taken is 4 hours now that depends on uh, what charger you are using so uh, let's come back to the uh, build quality of this uh, speaker as i said uh, the build quality is really good and uh, uh, it says that it waterproof or water resistance so i think this yes this would be and it's shockproof as well so yes this is very sturdy uh, so the controls are over here and if you see it properly uh, it's a dark background so let me just power on by a uh, long press on this phone you plugged into nirvana okay so it's just said you plugged into nirvana and uh, the volume rockers are over here and uh, to get the bluetooth on uh, you have to uh, long press over here so at the back panel we see that this is the uh, DC 5 volt uh, charger and uh, you get the aux port over here so I'll just quickly uh, get this uh, of, uh, out and uh, we'll see what are the ports so yes we see that uh, this is the uh, the power the power adapter charge port and this is the 3.5 mm jack so this one is the aux out port so if you can if you want to plug in with uh, your phone directly using the cable so uh, according to me uh, under 3000 this is a, a, a definitely a good speaker so let's just quickly uh, play a sample song and uh, we'll see how is the sound quality So guys, how was that? Please mention in the comment and uh, I would reply back to your comment. So guys, according to me, uh, this is definitely not a portable speaker. But if you look at the form factor and if you look at the uh, 
you know how it fits in your hand i would say that it's a good travel speaker but again that is this this one is the heavy speaker so as per the sound quality i would say that uh, the basses were a, a mid bass the treble was good and the voice quality or the clarity was good so you can't compare this with bose or uh, jbl but uh, in this price range this one is a monster uh, again this is the uh, this is water resistant shock proof again so this is a good option if you if you want this to be with you when you travel during the rainy season so this is definitely a good buy in the uh, 3000 price range and uh, you get nowadays you get uh, uh, cash backs on multiple banks so guys i would say you can definitely go for this speaker and uh, once you buy this if you like this speaker please mention that in my comments that will really help so guys thank you for watching this video and you can subscribe to my channel like this video and share this video and uh, thank you again you have a great day bye bye